OK, why can't I identify as a black lesbian? <laughs> well, firstly, I mean... It was I'm her. serious. I'm serious. If I can identify as anything mm -hmm. without any need to prove I'm actually what that is, I, I why think... can't I, on International Women's Day, say, I'm Piers Morgan, I'm a black lesbian? I think taking it to a kind of absurd no, status... No, no. I think, I think we're that's talking what... talking about quite a With respect, I think that thing. you've already opened the absurdity door by saying it is limitless. You can do what you like. Anyone can say... I'm a woman. So I simply ask you, why can't I? I mean, this point kind of ridicules trans people to an extent. Actually, I think, I think what you said ridicules trans people. Because actually people who, who go through the full process of transition, who actually go through what we used to call a sex change, which I don't think you can muck around with original biology, but those who actually go through surgical procedure over a number of years, I've got great respect for that very difficult journey they go on. I have zero respect for people who just wallop their hand up and go, suddenly, I'm a woman and I want all the rights that a woman has and I want to compete, say, in sport. I'm a six-foot-four-inch athlete, sprinter, swimmer, whatever, who's competed very mediocrely in male sport. I now want to come in and crush women in swimming pools and in sprinting events and break all their records, perhaps irrevocably, just by saying, I'm a woman. I think that is the absurdity you were talking about. My response was to say... Well, if it's limitless, why can't I then say whatever I want to say? And you say immediately, as I knew you would, well, that's ridiculous. But my point is, you were being ridiculous.